Hello, and welcome to Compline this evening. For our Compline service, we're using the Book of Common Prayer, starting on page 722. Our psalm for today is Psalm 100. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Praise ye the Lord. The Lord's name be praised. Psalm 100. Be joyful in the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness, and come before his presence with a song. Be ye sure that the Lord, he is God. It is he that hath made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people, and the sheep of his pasture. O go your way into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him, and speak good of his name. For the Lord is gracious, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth from generation to generation. Now the God of peace that brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus Christ, that great shepherd of the sheep, through the blood of the everlasting covenant, make you perfect in every good work to do his will, working in you that which is well-pleasing in his sight, through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. Thanks be to God. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For thou hast redeemed me, O Lord, thou God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray, that with thy wonted favor thou wouldst be our guard and keeper now. From all ill dreams defend our eyes, from nightly fears and fantasies. Tread underfoot our ghostly foe, that no pollution we may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, thine only Son, who with the Holy Ghost in thee doth live and reign eternally. Amen. Keep us as the apple of an eye. Hide us under the shadow of thy wings. Preserve us, O Lord, waking and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, now lettest thou thy servant depart in peace according to thy word. For mine eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face of all people, to be a light to lighten the Gentiles, and to be the glory of thy people Israel. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Preserve us, O Lord, waking, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Now let us confess our faith with the words of the Apostles' Creed, saying, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who is conceived by the Holy Ghost, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, dead, and buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sitteth on the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the quick and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Let us pray. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, 
and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive them that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Blessed art thou, Lord God of our fathers, to be praised and glorified above all forever. Let us bless the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Let us praise him and magnify him forever. Blessed art thou, O Lord, in the firmament of heaven, to be praised and glorified above all forever. The Almighty and most merciful Lord, guard us and give us his blessing. Amen. Now let's confess our failures and faults, trusting in the faithfulness of our God and our Father. We confess to God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, that we have sinned in thought, word, and deed through our own grievous fault. Wherefore, we pray God to have mercy upon us. Almighty God, have mercy upon us. Forgive us all our sins and deliver us from all evil. Confirm and strengthen us in all goodness and bring us to life everlasting through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. May the Almighty and merciful Lord grant unto you pardon and remission of all your sins, time for amendment of life, and the grace and the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Wilt thou not turn again and quicken us, that thy people may rejoice in thee? O Lord, show thy mercy upon us, and grant us thy salvation. Vouchsafe, O Lord, to keep us this night without sin. O Lord, have mercy upon us, have mercy upon us. O Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come unto thee. Visit, we beseech thee, O Lord, this place, and drive from it all the snares of the enemy. Let thy holy angels dwell herein to preserve us in peace. And may thy blessing be upon us evermore, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Look down, O Lord, from thy heavenly throne, and illuminate the darkness of this night with thy celestial brightness. And from the sons of light banish the deeds of darkness, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. We will lay us down in peace and take our rest. For it is thou, Lord, only that makest us dwell in safety. The Lord be with you and with thy spirit. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The almighty and merciful Lord, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, bless us and preserve us. Amen. I'm glad you're able to join us for Compline this evening. God bless you. May he keep you. May he make his face to shine upon you. May he lift up his countenance upon you and grant you his peace. I hope you have a good night's sleep and then wake up in the morning early and refreshed. God bless.